Hi guys and welcome to day 286 of Daily Dose of Dutch. I'm normally not doing um, any moving uh, live streams but today I was walking back from a game of squash and um, well I thought let's let's do Daily Dose of Dutch now and for the same for the simple reason that it's Friday again and so many times on Friday um, well I do a review I look back at the week and I say so what have I achieved this week? Um, did I achieve what I planned to achieve, what I set out to achieve at the beginning of the week? And the only way that we can achieve things is actually by doing things. By doing things. So we're now in the third month of the year, so it is March. And I'm not sure what you um, set out to do at the beginning of this year. What is it you want to achieve in 2017? Because have you actually taken the action? Are you actually doing the stuff that you need to do to achieve those things? Because if you're not, then nothing is going to change. So if you wanted to lose some weight at the beginning of the year and you haven't changed your eating habits and you haven't changed your fitness regime, you're not doing any sports, chances are that you're not anywhere close where you want it to be maybe in March if you wanted to get fitter but you haven't been to the gym you might have subscribed to a gym membership and you maybe have some great intentions to get fit but unless you're actually going on that treadmill or going for that run or going for that bike ride or going for that game of squash nothing is going to change now sometimes we can be let down by the fact that things are not working out as we want them, to want them to work out but here's the good thing there's still 10 months left we're only only in March of 2017 so there's 10 months left of the year and sometimes we just need to get going so what is it that's stopping you what is it what's the nudge that you need well maybe it is this daily dose of Dutch that you think maybe I should I need to go out Find a buddy to go out with if you want to get fit. Um, write down a diet for a week if you want to change your eating habits. These things do work and the same in business. What is it you want to achieve with your business? Because so often I meet people and in December they're moaning that the year has been the same or the year has been dreadful or the year hasn't panned out as what I had hoped it would pan out and then you say so what have you done the whole year? Have you changed anything? Because if you don't change the things you're doing, the outcome is not going to change. I've quoted Einstein before. I, insanity, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. Well, in our lives, in our business, in our jobs, in our departments, wherever we work or what we do, whatever departments of our life, if we don't change the things we're doing, we should not be surprised that the outcome doesn't change. So if you are unhappy with your results, if you're unhappy with your outcome, you need to change. So do that review. Look back at the week. What could you have done different? What could you have done more? What should you have not done? This week I was at Jim Collins. Go to my live stream from this uh, Tuesday, the live event at Jim Collins. He said it's great to have a to-do list, but also make sure you get a stop doing list. Which things should you stop doing? Because those are often far more effective than just the things that you need to do. Well, I hope that has been useful. Uh, I hope the sound is okay. I used the, the microphone, so hopefully the noise of the cars is not too loud. Um, I got a few more miles to walk. So have a fantastic evening. If you just woke up in New Zealand or Australia, have a fantastic Saturday, have a lovely weekend, and I'll see you again tomorrow for another Daily Dose of Dutch.